Hello, hello, everybody. Check this. Check this baby out. This is our new configuration for S FinTech S45 Mini. OK, so this is going to be the new version, new release, new version 250 cc front tank. And see, that's a barrel, right? And 250 cc rear tank. So they hooked up together. Yeah, we shake the, the screen on purpose. Just make you guys daisy. OK, so check this is just regular version for S45. 13 inches barrel, 350 cc front tank, and also this 250cc tank on the rear, right? So totally will be 600cc tanks on S45 regular. Check this muzzle brake. Yeah, we did it again. So this is muzzle brake is from Jim. Okay, Toxicoma. So yeah, so we offer you the more selections. It's like uh, we don't have, you can select to use the tank or use the folding stock for rear. And also you can select the muscle, either use Bing tax muscle or use James muscle. Okay, so that's two two se separate selections. So the, the old S45, old S45 come and uh, S45 mini and S45 regular and S45 old series, right? Except the, the ultra and the super will come with the real tank. Okay, so uh, no more folding stock. Okay, check those. Right, so you can have another choice is select a different muscle break. Okay, remember, let me remind again. There will be no more folding stock for S45. S45 regular, S45 mini will, all, will only come with 250cc rear tank with CNC stock. Okay, so no more, no more folding stock. Okay, so. And the three gun together, you guys can see it. And you want to see, see and how it works. I uh, PD did some tests on uh, S45 357 mini test and issued a couple of runs. So let's watch the following video to see what's going on on P's side. So right now I'm handing to P. Let's take a look at Enjoy, buddy. Bye bye, Evan, everybody. Today Check what it. What we did is we put two 255cc air tanks on it to give you a total of 510 cc's and today what we're going to do with this little jobber right here is we're going to throw some 130 grain 357s into it um i got a couple of mags here made up for the 357 minis um we're going to try to get some chronograph numbers if i go a little slow doing the chronograph numbers um it's probably because i'm trying to sight in the red dot too to see what we can get for some groups at about 23 yards or so where i'm set up out here on the farm but we're focusing on how many shots can we get out of the s45 mini in 357 with 510 cc's of onboard air we're going to be starting right about 4400 PSI, we're just underneath that mark of the 4500. I'm going to say it's 4400 PSI. We're going to shoot it down until we get nothing left or we end up going full auto on it, see how many shots we can get through it. Again, I only have two mags. They each hold eight shots, not the six shots in 357. So we're going to see if we can get at least 16 shots out of 510 cc's, 255, 255. If everything works out great here today, these will be on the website and pre-orders through me and my partner by the end of the week, I believe, hopefully. Um, we have stuff coming soon, hopefully sooner than later. And this is going to be one of the packages we're going to be putting together with twin 255 air tanks, nice, short, compact, 357. S45 Mini. Stay tuned and I'll try to get set up here so we can get some chronograph numbers. Seven nineteen. Seven oh seven. Six ninety three. Six 
six duplicate, six ninety three. Six eighty two. Six seventy five. Six sixty seven. Six fifty four, and that's our entire clip. We're going to take a quick walk down here and we're going to see how I group at about 25 yards. Shooting 130 grain 357s at about 25 yards on a 3 inch target. We're going to see how we did here. Okay, that's not too bad. Three, six, seven, eight. Two groups of three. And to the right, just two. And that's with a little red dot that I have on there. Not really sighted in. That's just a shoot and go type setup right there. So that's what we have for the 357 S45 Mini with two 255 cc air tanks on it. Uh, I'll crunch some numbers when I put the video together. And, uh, We'll take it from there and see how we do. One full magazine brought us right down to about the 4,000 mark. So we're going to shoot another eight rounds through here quick and see what 16 rounds brings us down to. See if I can come in on that target a little bit better for you guys. So you can see where I'm coming in at. There we go. Let me load up the next mag. And we'll do another air pressure check. See how we do with the next group. We're going to stay on the same target for now. eight more we are now sitting at try to get this in a frame for you guys we are now sitting at roughly three thousand we're